In this video, we are going to see an introduction to discrete mathematics. So what is discrete mathematics? So it's the study of mathematics that falls outside the realm of calculus. And calculus is the study of continuous math concepts, whereas discrete maths is the study of separable, countable or quantified objects. So it involves mathematical reasoning along with creativity and problem solving. So some examples of discrete mathematics will be like we have digital signals or discrete signals and then we have analog or continuous signals in our digital signal processing. Then uh, we see that computers operate in discrete manner. Machine language is a series of bits and bytes and we know that bit is just stores either 0 or 1. So every bit will store either 0 or 1 and bytes will be 8 bits together will form 1 byte. So uh, the machine language completely works on bits and bytes and each byte is just 0 or 1. So these are also discrete values. So another example could be some uh, logical expression like if condition 1 is satisfied and condition 2 is satisfied or condition 3 is satisfied then give some result 1. So this kind of expressions also fall under the category of discrete mathematics. Now let's see what are the key concepts or the key uh, broad areas that we study under discrete mathematics. So the first is set theory. Then we have logical or formal reasoning or we call it logic. Then we have number theory, combinatorics and graph theory. So we will study all of these in detail in our further videos. So this was a brief overview of uh, what uh, is the definition of discrete mathematics and what uh, areas, what subjects do we study under discrete mathematics. So stay tuned for my future videos and don't forget to subscribe my channel.